What's up guys? It's Dan. I'm back here. Craft Brew Dude. It's a good name. Why not? So, this is what we got going today, guys. Stone Brewing. 22nd Anniversary Any Matter Double IPA. The No Haze Double IPA. 9.1 alcohol by volume. 12 ounce. Uh, yeah, guys, this is a pretty awesome beer we got going here. Um, Stone never lets us down, usually. Um, I got my hands on this one at my store. I thought this was a good one to share. I've literally been drinking beers for I don't know how many days straight now, and I have not been recording. I'm pretty embarrassed about it. Um, I just work too much, guys. I wish I could record all the beers I've been drinking. I've been drinking, like, uh, Hazy Jane, Brew Dog, The Oracle, Bells, um, tons of Old Nation, um, tons of other stones, tons of Lagunitas. I just have not been recording it. Um, if this channel picks up, you're damn straight that I'll record every single one of them. Um, but anyways, back to this beer today, guys. We've got an awesome limited stone beer. Uh, that's pretty damn exciting. So um, let's hop into it. These guys are pretty passionate about no haze, and they're pretty obvious about it here on the label. Um, we've got a big guy here. This is a big beer. You do not want to drink this and then start driving around. This is not a good idea. Um, but this says on the back here, Stone 22nd Anniversary Double IPA is clean, crisp, perfectly filtered uh, IPA that reinforces giant, juicy, hop-forward IPAs. Um, and then it goes on, you know, kind of to describe the story behind it. Um, yeah, let's just dive right into it, guys. Cool label. Um, let's see, I'm losing you guys here. Hold on. Uh, this was bottled on 724.18. Today is 8518. This is very fresh. We're not going to get much more fresh than this, guys. So let's hop in right, right into it here. I've got my awesome shorts bottle opener. Thank you, Imperial. They did give this to me for free. Um, I do a lot of business with shorts. Uh, so I got to thank those guys over there. Appreciate it, guys. So let's hop into it. Beauty. Cool little label. They got their stone brewing um, social media going on inside the cap here. Probably can't see it, but just has their Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest link. Um, so let's hop into it. See what we got. Let me straighten this out a little bit. I can't even see myself. It's so sunny out here, guys. Let's see what we got. Boy, I wish I did more reviews, guys. I'm telling you. I have been drinking a lot of beer lately, and it's not reflecting well on my waistline. Wow, this is beauty. Kind of poured, I poured it aggressively. I got nearly two fingers head. Um, copper, golden, deep yellow. Very carbonated. Bubbles rising all the way to the top rapidly. Small bubbles inside it. Then we have crisp, compact bubbles all the way to the top with some bigger bubbles uh, submerged in the middle. Very nice looking beer. You can tell that this is a nice double IPA. Let's get into the smell, guys. Wow, super clean. I'm getting a lot of malt in there. Yeah, just real, real nice hops. There's a nice, huge hop presence in there. Um, Super clean, super clean for being a double IPA, and uh, lots of uh, orange peel, a lot of, like real, real orange peel that's thrown in there, and just oh man, it's nice and citrusy, but predominantly orange. So instead of just talking about it all day about the smell, let's let's dive into it, guys. Cheers. Thank you, Stone. Um, this is a great beer. They didn't send it to me, but I still appreciate this beer. I think this looks great. Let's dive in. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, this is stone-esque. Very stone-esque. Wow. 9.1%. Incredibly smooth and crisp. Unbelievable how well they hit it. 
you're you're just getting this big hop presence in it, just huge hops, and then it's subdued by this orange peel. Again, I got the orange and the aroma. Tons of orange, tons of malt. Obviously, for this big of an ABV, it's it's super super well hidden. Stone did a great job brewing this beer. Um, it's super enjoyable. It shouldn't be this enjoyable, actually, guys. 9.1%, double IPA. Yeah, it's just, it's great. Wow. That, I will go on record. I've had tons of beers. You've never, you've never seen me drink all the ones I've had, but, um, wow. This, this is pretty special, guys. It's, it's, um, it's super enjoyable. It's one of the most enjoyable double IPAs I've ever had, West Coast style. Um, for this kind of ABV, you're usually looking at an enjoyable East Coast style, but nope, not today, guys. We got this West Coast limited 22nd anniversary ale that was just absolutely executed, 100% to the fullest potential. They did an awesome job. I am just loving the way that this beer came out, guys. It's awesome. Yeah, yeah, I have nothing more to say. It's just uh, a good amount of citrus thrown in. Um, the bitterness is there, but it's so well hidden. It is unbelievable. Usually with this kind of big boy that we're drinking, um, you're usually getting a great great chunk of this alcohol that's coming into it. But nope, not on this stone. You're getting that clean, crisp finish. It finishes like it's almost like a session in a way, but it's obviously so much more than that um that's it guys stone's awesome um i highly highly recommend you get this one if you can get your hands on it it is super enjoyable um and you can appreciate the the work that went into this one uh looks like it's retailing about 15.99 that's what i got it for in um michigan and that's what we retail it for so it's it's got a big cost on it but hey guys um old nation beers guess what those are 16.99 at times 13.99 for four 16 ounce cans you're getting six 12 ounce cans uh bottles i mean and they're awesome so drink it fresh guys it was just recently bottled go get your hands on this one thank you craft brew dude over and out